Africa has a diverse range of wildlife and fantastic opportunities for wildlife viewing. It is also home to a wide range of dangerous animals, including some of the world's most lethal, which have killed a significant number of people. In this video, we go in-depth on the most dangerous animals in Africa and rank the species according to their ferocity and the estimated number of fatalities they account for annually. It's important to remember that while there are some extremely dangerous animals on this list, the majority of them are restricted to national parks and game reserves, where following basic safari rules eliminates almost all risk of death. With that in mind, our video today presents the list of the top 15 most dangerous animals on the African continent. Be sure to leave a comment, like and subscribe for more intriguing and thrilling future videos. <laughs> Although it is non-venomous and rarely kills humans, the African rock python snake is widely feared and regarded as deadly due to its powerful jaws and aggressive nature. It is one of the six largest snake species in the world and can grow to be more than six meters long. The African snake is a constrictor and because it lacks venom, it kills animals by encircling and literally squeezing the life out of them. In addition to this, the massive giant has long curved teeth that can inflict deep wounds. Although the snake is not endangered, it is threatened by habitat loss and poaching. Some cultures in sub-Saharan Africa see it as a delicacy, which may endanger its population. It can be found almost everywhere in sub-Saharan Africa, from Senegal to Ethiopia and Somalia, and south to Namibia and South Africa. Many people who venture into the waters around southern Africa are terrified of the great white shark. It is without a doubt the most aggressive shark when it comes to human encounters, accounting for the majority of fatal shark attacks in Africa and around the world. Great white sharks can grow to be 20 feet long and weigh between 1,500 and 4,000 pounds. However, the largest great white ever recorded is estimated to weigh 5,000 pounds. Great white sharks charge their prey at speeds of up to 40 kilometers per hour. Take one large bite, then back off, allowing their prey to bleed to death before eating it. When it comes to humans, great white sharks typically take a test bite and then retreat. However, in approximately 20% of cases, the victim dies from blood loss caused by a single bite. Humans are not typically the prey of white sharks. According to studies, when a great white shark sees a swimmer or surfer from below, they may not be able to tell them apart from their favorite meal, seals. African wild dogs, commonly known as painted dogs, are pack animals native to sub-Saharan Africa. African hunting dogs are extremely social animals with a hyper-carnivorous diet. The African wild dog hunts common medium-sized antelopes as part of a pack. Along with the cheetah, they are Africa's only predominantly diurnal big predators. They hunt by approaching prey discreetly and then chasing it at up to 66 kilometers per hour for 10 to 60 minutes. African wild dogs nowadays typically roam the open plains and sparse woodlands of sub-Saharan Africa. Botswana, Zimbabwe, Namibia, Zambia, Tanzania, and Mozambique have the largest populations. The spotted hyena is the largest known member of the hyenida family and the only species of hyena native to sub-Saharan Africa. The spotted hyena is one of the most social African animals and the most successful of Africa's great carnivores. Hyenas in Ethiopia were said to eat a lot of the bodies of those who perished in the Red Terror and the attempted coup in 1960. Hyena attacks on people in southern Sudan rose during the Second Sudanese Civil War, when human corpses were easily accessible to them. Hyenas habituated to scavenging on human corpses may acquire daring behaviors against living people. Spotted hyenas are found in sub-Saharan Africa to northern southern Africa in Chad, South Sudan, Kenya, Tanzania, Angola, Botswana, and parts of South Africa.
Leopards are one of the big five game animals native to Africa and are found throughout most of Sub-Saharan Africa. Of all the big cats, the leopard's range is the largest. In Sub-Saharan African nations like Zambia, Botswana, South Africa, Kenya, and Tanzania, they are widely present. They have an exceptional ability to adapt to a wide range of habitats within Africa and have a very diverse diet. Most leopards avoid humans, but humans may be targeted as prey on occasion. The majority of healthy leopards prefer wild prey to humans, but injured, sickly, or struggling cats, as well as those with a lack of regular prey, may resort to hunting humans and become habituated to it. Rhinos can weigh up to 2,800 kilograms, making them the second largest animals on land in terms of sheer size only behind elephants. They are extremely massive and powerful animals, known for their somewhat cranky and easily irritable nature, as well as their keen sense of smell, albeit their terrible eyesight. This keen sense of smell makes them dangerous because the smell of humans usually triggers them to charge at person or vehicle. Despite their tank-like build, their powerful hind legs propel them forward, and once they reach top speeds, they run on their toes. So, even if you're an elite athlete, it's unlikely that you'll be able to outrun a rhinoceros. Rhinos can outrun any human on record. Usain Bolt, for example, reached nearly 44.7 kilometers per hour in a 100-meter race during the World Championships in Berlin in 2009. This is the fastest human speed ever recorded, and he only went for about 20 meters. Rhinos can charge at speeds of up to 64 kilometers per hour and have two large, sharp horns, so keep your distance and never get between a mother and her baby, or anywhere near an older male. Although the black rhino is more aggressive in general, both black and white rhinos charge when threatened, which can lead to human death. Rhino mothers with calves are fiercely protective of their calves and will attack anything that they perceive as a threat. Most wild African rhinos are now found in just four countries, South Africa, Namibia, Zimbabwe, and Kenya, mainly roaming grassland and open savanna. Lions are known as the kings of the jungle. Because of their intimidating stature and reputation, they are near the top of the food chain. They are apex predators and have earned their reputation as one of the most efficient hunters in Africa. While humans are not their natural prey, an estimated 200 people are killed by lions each year. Sick male lions, as well as opportunistic attacks in areas where the lion's natural prey has been depleted, are primarily responsible for this death rate. Although there have been a few instances of tourists or tour guides being killed by lions while on a safari, these incidents are incredibly rare. Locals living in or near African game reserves on a daily basis make up the vast majority of lions' victims. African lions were once found across the majority of the continent, but are now only found in sub-Saharan Africa, with 80% found in eastern or southern Africa. Lions have vanished from 12 sub-Saharan African countries in recent decades, nonetheless. Tanzania has three of the five largest populations. The Cape Buffalo, also known as the Widowmaker, or the Black Death, is without a doubt one of Africa's most dangerous animals. These ferocious and unpredictable beasts can reach 1.7 meters in height and weigh up to 1,000 kilograms. They have no fear and will attack any predator that attempts to steal their young. Although they frequently travel in herds, they are one of the few African animals to aggressively pursue and kill people if alone. When a Cape buffalo is injured, or when one of the herd's cows is being attacked, that is when it becomes most aggressive. A buffalo that is enraged will circle and stalk its prey, waiting for the ideal opportunity to rip apart its adversary with its enormous thick horns. When fending off predators, Cape buffalo are also known to exhibit mobbing behavior. Imagine a herd of enraged Cape buffaloes charging at you at up to 35 miles per hour. Perhaps the moniker of the Black Death is earned when you are this scary. Tanzania, Zimbabwe, Zambia, 
the Democratic Republic of the Congo, and South Africa have the highest estimated buffalo populations, with Tanzania having at least six times more buffalo than any other. Nile crocodiles are the continent's largest freshwater predators found in almost every major river and many lakes. They can be found in Egypt in the north, through Central and East Africa, down to South Africa. The Nile crocodile is known for its aggressive nature and is the crocodile species most responsible for fatal human attacks, killing an estimated 300 people each year, though many believe the actual number may be as high as 3,000. Crocodiles are indiscriminate predators who attack any animal that comes within reach, including people. They are known for their ambush hunting technique. They typically attack by leaping out of the water, seizing their prey in their vicious jaws, dragging them back into the water where they drown them, and then hiding them under submerged branches or rocks to be eaten later. Crocodiles can move extremely quickly in and out of water. Once they've caught you, their gaping mouths filled with 68 terrifyingly sharp, banana-shaped teeth bite down with a force of 5,000 pounds per square inch, the most powerful bite of any animal. Human attacks typically happen when individuals are bathing close to lake and river shores, as well as when fishermen are getting in and out of their boats. Children are more at risk than adults due to their size and crocodile attacks on humans, where the mortality rate hovers around 40%. It has been demonstrated that crocodile attacks are more likely during the warmer months when they are more active. The only way to outwit the croc is to exploit his weakness, which funny enough, happens to be its mouth. The muscles responsible for opening its mouth are extremely weak, so if you ever find yourself wrestling a crocodile, your best chance of survival is to keep its trap closed. Then, find a stick to keep its mouth open, so that when you finally let go, you're not the first thing it bites down on. With weights of up to 7,000 kilograms, elephants stand as the world's largest land animals. They are often very unpredictable, although older bull elephants, young males and elephants with babies are especially dangerous to anything in their path. Unprovoked attacks on humans by African elephants have been reported on occasion, usually by male elephants in musk, a sexually active period when testosterone levels increase. Males can grow to be 13 feet tall and weigh over 7,000 pounds, and both males and females have large tusks that can grow to be 8 feet long and weigh nearly 100 pounds. They are also highly intelligent creatures with brains similar to humans and many other mammals in terms of general connectivity in functional areas, with several unique structural differences as well. While they appear to be relatively calm animals, African elephants cause approximately 500 human fatalities each year by trampling and crushing their victims. The result of combining their weight, size, and intelligence is an elephant whose rage can cause devastating consequences. Elephants have been known to attack villages and go on killing sprees, usually in response to human provocations. Elephants are much more aggressive in areas where poaching occurs or the elephant's habitat is threatened. They are fearless and fiercely protective of their herds and young. They can be vengeful, charging at 15 miles per hour to trample you to the ground if they feel threatened. The largest populations are in southern and eastern African countries, including Botswana, Zimbabwe, Tanzania, Kenya, Namibia, Zambia, and South Africa. The black mamba is the longest venomous snake in Africa and the second longest venomous snake in the world, behind the king cobra. It is one of the deadliest and most feared snakes in Africa, recognized more by the black color of its mouth than by its body, which is an olive or grayish brown. The venom of the black mamba is extremely potent, containing a combination of neurotoxins, which damage nerve tissue and cardiotoxins, which impede heart function. It is often estimated that the amount of venom in each bite is enough to kill 12 full-grown men within an hour. The snake is also known to chase people and can move as fast as 12 miles per hour. 
This composition, combined with the rapidity with which the venom takes action, is exceedingly lethal. Prior to the advent of an anti-venom, the bite of a black mamba had a 100% death rate. While a bite need not be fatal, the sufferer should seek medical attention right away because the venom can start working in as little as 10 minutes and cause death in as little as a few hours. Black mambas are prevalent in sub-Saharan Africa, particularly in South and East Africa. They can be found from Eritrea to South Africa and as far west as Namibia. Despite their rarity in Western Africa, there have been sporadic sightings. These sightings could be the result of inaccurate reporting, surviving populations from a former, broader range, or new populations, which would suggest an extending range. Many people frequently fail to realize that among all the continent's large animals, the highly territorial hippopotamus is the deadliest to humans. This is probably because there are so many dangerous animals in Africa. Perhaps people mistake hippos for harmless giant globs because they are herbivores. But despite being herbivores, hippos are thought to kill an astounding 3,000 people each year. While female hippos can become very aggressive if they feel that something is getting in the way of them and their young, who stay in the water while they feed on the shore, Male hippos fiercely defend their territories, such as the banks of rivers and lakes. Hippos can reach 1,500 kilograms in weight, making them Africa's third largest animal after elephants and rhinos, and can run at speeds of up to 30 kilometers per hour on land. When you combine this with their aggressive nature, agility in and out of the water, and sharp, half meter teeth and incredibly huge jaws, it's easy to see why hippos can be such a terrifying creature to encounter. Hippos can still be found in the rivers and lakes of Northern Democratic Republic of the Congo, Uganda, Tanzania, and Kenya, as well as in Ethiopia, Somalia, Sudan, the Gambia, and South Africa. Setsi flies are bloodsuckers. They resemble a common house fly in appearance. Despite this, it is responsible for approximately 10,000 human deaths each year. The parasite that causes sleeping sickness is carried by the tsetz fly. It also carries another parasite that kills livestock, such as cattle. Although the puff adder is not as venomous as the black mamba, it is responsible for more bites and fatalities. In fact, the puff adder is responsible for the majority of fatal snake bites in Africa each year. This is due to a variety of factors. For starters, the puff adder is more numerous and widespread in Africa and has a tendency to show up in highly populated regions. This naturally aggressive snake is very confrontational and has an excellent camouflage. Where most snakes retreat, the snake's sandy hue helps them blend in so well that it holds still when people approach. This makes people frequently come upon them unaware, stomping on them and forcing the adder to strike in self-defense. The puff adder is found in savannah and grasslands from Morocco and Western Arabia throughout Africa, except for the Sahara and rainforest regions. It is thought to kill more people than any other African snake, causing about 32,000 deaths and many more impairments each year. Its venom is exceedingly toxic, capable of causing significant tissue necrosis, hypotension, coagulopathy, thrombocytopenia, and spontaneous bleeding, and is thought to have evolved to paralyze prey and start the digestion process. However, unlike other of its close cousins, the venom of the puff adder acts very slowly, and death can be avoided in 90 to 95% of cases with adequate treatment. If you have ever been to Africa, then you should know that your arch nemesis isn't really any of the giant beasts or slithering serpents mentioned. Your worst nightmare could well be the tiniest insect on this list. The tiny mosquito may appear less impressive than the other large creatures on this list, but it is by far the most dangerous animal in Africa and the world. 
Many mosquito species in sub-Saharan Africa transmit a variety of potentially fatal diseases, including yellow fever, Zika virus, West Nile virus, dengue fever, and of course malaria. These diseases kill over a million Africans each year, and a reported 3,000 African children are killed by malaria alone. Wearing light colors, using spray or lotion repellents and insecticides, fumigating and sleeping under mosquito nets are all ways to avoid mosquito bites. That concludes our list of the 15 most dangerous animals in Africa, as determined by the estimated number of humans killed each year. Have you been shocked by the list? Or were you expecting something similar to this? Also, are there any dangerous African animals that we haven't mentioned? Please share your thoughts in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video, watch also the next video on your screen which looks at the Nilothic people and the secret why they're the tallest, darkest and thinnest people on earth. Be sure to give the video a like and subscribe to the channel for amazing daily videos.